Welcome to another Ayehu iShare demo. Today, we'll learn how to automate alert notification and escalation procedures using iShare. Ayehu iShare is a powerful IT process automation solution that provides out-of-the-box notification and escalation capabilities, allowing you to automate incident management. Use iShare's bidirectional communication tools to send and receive alerts using email, SMS, phone, and instant message to control the automated workflows remotely all from your mobile device. Let's see how it works. This workflow involves an IIS failure recovery procedure requiring interactive decision making by the user. Use the advanced communicate action in order to define your alert notification and escalation process in the right place where you need it. You can choose between three types of recipients, a user, group, or a duty, which uses iShare's integrated shift management system. We'll select our first level of support, Michael. Select the required communications method, you can choose between email, SMS, phone, or IM, or even trigger them all simultaneously. Let's define the reply time to 5 minutes, so the workflow will wait long enough for a reaction from the user. You can edit and customize the message instead of using the default alert. Just click the Edit button. Michael here will receive the results of several actions performed by iShare and will be prompted to reply yes in order to take ownership. Now, John is the second level support. He'll receive an SMS in the event that Michael didn't reply. You can edit his message as well. In this way, you can keep adding additional users in order to create your escalation procedure. Now let's take a look at the last response action. This sends a few optional follow-up actions to the user who replied to the previous communicate action. Notice that you don't need to select a specific communication channel or a specific user, since iShare will continue to contact the owner in the same way he initially replied. Now, let's switch to the iShare dashboard to see how this process works. As soon as iShare receives an alert from a monitoring system, a new incident is opened in the dashboard and our workflow is initiated. Let's switch to the Active Logs tab in order to watch the workflow in progress. After performing a few initial checks, the iShare workflow contacts Michael with the result of those checks. His name appears in the Assign column. Notice that the color of his name is yellow since he hasn't responded yet. After five minutes, iShare sends a text message to our second level recipient, John Smith. You'll notice now that Michael's color has changed to red while John has been added to the assigned column as well. Now here's the message as it shows up on John's iPhone. Next, iShare receives John's response. His color now has turned to green. That means that anyone who views this dashboard knows that John is aware of the problem and is taking care of it. Now, iShare sends John another text message with three possible response actions. And this is how that message looks. John decides to reset the IIS and replies with a reset command. iShare ceases answer and executes the IIS reset. Then iShare rechecks the website, finds that it's up, and then closes the incident and sends a recovery message to John. Here's how that looks. That's all there is to it. This concludes our alert notification and escalation with a Yahoo iShare demo. For further information, please visit our website at www.ayahu.com.